Good morning. Good morning. What's everybody doing? Spilling water. Can you? He's trying to attack. Okay. This is a real bad morning. Good morning, Riley. Um, he tried How are you, to buddy? The cap of my water. Right. And it made, and also that tablet fizzed in my mouth, and it came back up once. Then I tried to get. Good morning. Good morning. Ignore my hair. Get it down. Welcome to each beautiful day. Oh, I'm so wet. Right, right. I can't deal with you um, right now. Hold on. Let's just pause for a second. Look. 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 Right, little man. <laughs> Say good morning to mummy. <laughs> He's sitting on the lunch table. Wow. Here. Good morning, everybody. He's not allowed to do that. No. Can you take this? Because he will probably attack Medicine. it. Yep. He'll attack it. Like, the dude is brave. The dude is a hunter. He's a dude, good hunter. Rawr. Good morning. That's a lovely headband you're wearing. Well... You... I don't know if everyone's seen that video yet, so I don't know which order. Okay. I don't know oh, if you know dear. this, but it's... you're still oh. wearing your um, <laughs> yeah, neck bandana. Oh, um. Okay. Why have a hippopotamus? 21 hippopotamus. I said I'll be here in 30 seconds. 22 hippopotamus. I'm doing the washing! You're doing good, 22 hippopotamus. Oh my goodness me. 23 hippopotamus. Does it ever end? 24 hippopotamus. Sorry, it turned into hippopotamus. 25 hippopotamus. hippopotamus. Is that, 26 hippopotamus. Is that pajamas or is that day wear? Pajamas. Pajamas. Good to know. I forgot the number. Well, I gotta start again. One hippopotamus. Oh, they don't want to hear that. How's all your CSI Jeez. stuff going, miss? My little forensic psychologist. Right. So while Sir has been highlighting his little heart out over in the corner there, like oh, a weirdo. You mean last night spending hours doing more research, medical day research? Day and night. Yeah, I know. Sorry. But no, it's very important work that he's doing. More important than what I'm doing. I'm just doing things that... Anyway, we won't talk about how... My special interest at the moment is kind of useless. But anyway, it's a special interest and you can't help it, right? So, I'm on the train of the Gypsy Rose train. Oh no, not the Gypsy Rose train. Oh, I am. Did you know she Gypsy married Rose her brother? Gypsy Rose grandchild. She married her brother. What? Yep, check out. You said, what? Check out the deets on that online, on the, on the tube, the YouTube. True story at this point. The jury's out. We don't know for sure. Could be her half brother. Not kidding. I'm not kidding. I've looked at multiple videos. Next, basically, Nicholas Godijohn is the person who did the act. He is in jail for life. Gypsy got out in seven point something years. Yet they say eight, then they say seven, then they say eight. So the jury's out on that one too. Why lie? Um, I think it is closest to seven than eight. I think she got out of it a lot. Um, my, my take on it, sorry guys, but victim or not, she turned into an offender and a murderer. And I don't care because I've survived abuse and I would never, ever want to harm, definitely not murder, my abusers. Okay? Because even when you're abused by family, you still love them. That is a true story. So know that. But I'm just saying, right, this is really messed up. So I'm watching because Nicholas Godijohn is autistic. He's low functioning with many things. There's intellectual delays and disabilities and developmental delays. And I can relate to that. Now, I'm not saying what he's done is okay. I'm not saying that. I'm saying a fair trial was probably not done for that young man. I agree with that part. I also found out that his mum ended up overdosing on heroin not long after he went to jail. Very sad. That's sad. Gypsy manipulated him. There is also a video out there. It's really creepy, right? Really creepy. Okay, let's get that voice. It's meant to emulate creepy. Right. I'm doing good right with this. You know, being normal. So basically, there's this, there's this video, and it's just been out on YouTube. 
and it shows that she tells him off. Literally, her, sorry, her husband, the, the lovely man, that I think is going to get hurt in all this because he's a nice man. She's not a nice girl. That's my opinion. You can have your own, but I think she's an evil manipulator. I think she's disgusting. I think fame from, from being a murderer is so not okay. Okay? Because murder's final. There's no coming back. There's no healing. There's no nothing. It's death. So basically, I'm just saying she's evil. She should be in jail, and I don't like her. And I saw her with her husband squeezing him shoving his arm and told him in an interview with some kind of big person that was interviewing for TV to shut up. She thought obviously no one can hear, but I don't think she understands that um, when you are dealing with, because I've dealt with TV station Channel 7 before and I have um, been under their cameras and all that, they are very different to a camera that you could even buy the biggest fanciest camera but i'm telling you tv and and the, their cameras can pick up little tiny sounds yes riley i am trying to tell the story of gypsy rose for the people that might want to join the train yes that is your toilet it's robotic yes it picks up your poop so basically yes um she was rather rude and I saw her mother when I saw that and I went, yeah, yeah. However, you've got to realise, guys, just think about it. I'm not saying that she's not bad, but there was a discovery that she was sick with certain things. Boom. Not shocked. Anyway, second to that, the mother's dead. We don't know her story. We don't know who manipulated her, to be quite honest. She could have manipulated her mum to say, I can't walk, mum. Because she didn't want to go to school. Or, you know, some people, like, they can take my disability if they like, like to be, like, um, I don't know, like, what's, what's the wrong? I guess, like, victim, isn't it? It's gross. But she is acting like she's got a right to be famous and she's paid the price and she's done her time. No, you haven't paid the price. And guess what? I looked at the interview of Nicholas Godijon, the guy that did it, who's autistic and very, very special needs guys, by the way. We do need to keep that in mind here. Um, he actually said he only did this for Gypsy. So therefore, in law, the motive is he's not out there to just do it for the sake of it. It was for all of these like over the like leading up to it he she was sending him very provocative photos he's very young he's never been with a girl okay i know the psychology on that that is really like a, a manipulation huge just like manipulating a child it's so pathetic so he goes ahead with it but the tr more truth is going to come out, but he said that he can't tell until his trial comes. So we're going to listen to the facts on that. But I'm just saying, apparently the story is a little bit different to what Gypsy is saying. And I believe if he's in jail for life, so should she. Um, she is a murderer. She was involved. She was heavily involved. And she was laughing the day after in a hotel bed, motel bed, whatever you want to call it. Yep, she was laughing and, and being really sexually perverse, to be honest. Like, yeah, I, I, I don't think that you should ever, I mean, with your partner, you I mean, you, you, you do j make jokes, like weird jokes about things to do with sex. Yes, you do, right? I'm just saying, hers has a underlying tone of like, creepiness okay and so she's laughing who does that and you know what he said in the interview sorry that's what I was trying to get back to he goes I I feel guilty she was a nice lady what did gypsy say nothing she goes I don't feel guilty because I don't 
like she's I, I'm lucky I don't seem to have a conscience like that I didn't do the act she said she's never once said that she misses her mum and let me tell you this as a survivor of a mum that didn't really cope with me I love my mum and if I told you my story you'd go you know why would you with the betrayal and the hurt and all of that I do still love my mum so I'm just saying and many child abuse survivors say the same thing that if their parents changed and apologized and did all these things some families move forward and everything's fine literally so it depends on the situation yes but nobody wants to murder their parents that is not a normal reaction, basically. In in the stats, it doesn't show that. It doesn't show that it's normal to go, yep, I was abused, I'm gonna murder. I just murder. So she's just dodgy, I'm keeping an eye on her. Don't worry, I've got it, right? What do you call it? Detective Diane is on the case, and I'm watching that slimy snail. And I'm looking at Nicholas Gojohn's trial coming up, and I'm looking at the stuff. Not all has been revealed. Are you getting hooked into the CSI again? Real, <sighs> true crime. Have I missed anything? Is this another Gabby Petito 101? Have I missed anything? Well, she tried to shoot her mum herself with a gun. A BB gun, though. That's right. If you think that she's like, but she wasn't capable of doing the act. Mm -hmm. No, she is. She picked up a gun. It was a BB gun. But she didn't know that. She thought it was a gun. Ten shots fired directly at her mother. Uh-huh. She also was um, accused of manipulating her grandfather and accusing him of something. That's wrong. Next, um, we have the person from the comic con convention that she met a lot of people are talking about he's actually the one that started the Facebook page to support Nick go to John because she is that she's one of those women that manipulates using sex it's a bit like apparently in all the novels that the guys get into you know there's always this chick who's a spy and she gets them all into bed and she manipulates them <laughs> with you know what that stuff <laughs> Stuff that's meant to be genuine and like with people you love and all the rest of it. She uses that to do what she does with these men. She uses men. I mean, look at the guy she's with. Really? She had many people want to be with her in jail for when she got out and all the rest of it, be her partner. And she chose him and I'm not knocking him, not because of what he looks like, but I'm just saying, if you had the choice... I don't believe a person like herself, who looks like she's acting very vain, she is acting very vain, um, very narcissistic. I don't think it's a good dynamics relationship feel, to be built upon. I feel sorry for him though, because I think that, think about it, she took advantage of Nick Godijon, because she's, I reckon she's asked many people to do this before, and they're all being quiet because they don't want to be... I don't know, I guess responsible for not like reporting it maybe? I don't know. But I'm just saying, maybe there's laws that they can't say. I don't know American laws. But I'm just saying it's dodgy because at the end of the day, she has seen many men. She's not innocent. How can she be an innocent girl who's sheltered when she's going around town dating all these men online? She was licking the knife before it all happened. That's not normal. Who licks a knife? Who doesn't... Who, she claims to be like, I don't like blood and I don't like, I don't want to do the act. Rubbish, Gypsy Rose. I don't believe a damn word you say. And when you said, I'm not going back, you can't, no one's going to be able to make me go back to jail, basically. I'm like, well, jail is meant to be rehabilitation and you are not rehabilitated. You are a danger to society, absolutely. Whereas when I heard Nick literally say, I only did this for Gypsy and I feel guilty, I do feel really guilty because she was a really nice lady. No, he's trying to talk to you guys from the bottom of the tripod. Not how it works, son, but anyway, nice try. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Like, 
That is guilt. That is someone with a conscience. She admitted to not having a conscience. Find the video. Don't believe whatever I say. It's all backed up with other videos. In, out of her mouth. I'm just studying her pathology wise. Oh, oh my, my god. You guys just bunny hopped. Riley, off you go. Go play with your toys. Come here, my cheeky little monkey. Oh. So anyway, that's my news of the day. Is I'm studying this case. Um, and his trial is very soon. There's, okay. Yeah, soon. there's a Facebook page apparently or a group or something. I haven't joined mm -hmm. everything. I haven't got that far. But Nicholas go to John. Um, had extra footage that his parents had of him before and he's being like assessed you know mentally and all the rest of it ready for his trial so that's coming up so anyway these are all the latest things that have come out and um, she's just very manipulative so I don't think that she is someone that is a safe societal person what do you think Stay not tuned. rehabilitated. I'm sure is something she? else is gonna happen. Not rehabilitated, doesn't feel guilty. Nah. No. Um that's not someone that it, like should come out of prison and go, Hi, I'm allowed. Like she I think there was a comment and I haven't heard it, but I've heard it written that she said, I deserve to be famous. I actually don't think proceeds of crime, which this is what it is, anything on social media that she earns should be going towards proceeds of crime. Victims of crime. Victims of crime. You know? Because, or even like for lawyers for victims who need to go to court. I'm sorry, but she doesn't deserve a cent. She comes out of jail with a brand new iPhone. I don't have a brand new iPhone. Not bad, is it? Like, people with disability don't get anything. We always just struggle to get by. And this person is a murderer. Let's not forget that. Her own mum. Oh, I just want her dead. Because he even talked her out of it. Oh, we just can run away. We can just run away. Yeah, you could have run away, Gypsy. You could have run away. America's pretty big, I hear. Many states could have run away. You didn't. You didn't. Um, you hate your mum that much, you wanted to kill her. That's not normal. To hate your mother that much isn't normal either. So I'm just saying. End note. <laughs> I will won't bore you out. anymore. Well, I'm sure there's a few others that also are getting into true crime Maybe. and uh, yeah, anyone else? CSI, etc., and forensic stuff. If you do, oh, comment below. Who are you following? What are you interested in? Other particular channels that you watch to get the information and the goss? Comment below. Look, if I had a fancy computer, mm -hmm. I would show them all these clips and talk about I it, but know. I don't. We have limitations on I the don't. technology. I don't. I have a four hundred dollar laptop that I bought seven years ago. Uh, seven years ago. ago. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's not going to be out of. She's not playing very nicely either. The battery's dead on the damn thing. It's the cord dead. doesn't work. So anyway, it keeps going and it's awake and it and it's awake. Anyway, I was a bit lucky this morning. <laughs> It was. I wasn't it sure was. if you're awake or asleep, but awake or asleep. I said, I said, yeah, I know. It's like I you mean, wake up, say two words, and then you're back asleep again, <laughs> snoring. It's like, okay, no worries. I just don't shut up. <laughs> Even in your, you could talk underwater. In fact, you do. Oh, that sounds like my family. <laughs> when people say she doesn't talk, does she? Because I was selected mute, right? And very immature speech. So I could have been picked on for that too. I didn't speak and I didn't know how to communicate to strangers. But my family were big and I was always with my family. And I communicated a lot to certain family members, especially the autistic ones or the smart ones. Because it was like, I would ask them the most complex questions. And basically, it's so funny because people would say, oh, she's so quiet. And they'd go, oh my God. No, no, no. You don't know her. You don't know. She doesn't shut up. You go, really? Yeah, she doesn't shut up. <laughs> yeah, that's me. True story. True story. <clears throat> so what are we doing today, What yes? have you been doing, sir? Highlighting? No, well, that's more my job last night was highlighting and sending research articles to your medical team. Yes. To become available. Go figure. 
We have got a 36 degree day in Perth today, 39 Whoa. tomorrow, 41 Friday, 42 Saturday, 39 Sunday. I think she's going to be a hot week ahead. We're going to be frying. We're going to be hitting the pool today. We're going to be in the swimming pool. The pool of water is going to be cold today though. Because last night I didn't even need the aircon on. Doesn't that say a lot? That is true as well, but it is warming up definitely. But the water is freezing. Mm. Lovely. When my body goes in cold water, it is good for it, don't get me wrong. But the problem is I can't stay in it long enough. And I've got to do my exercises. And... Mm -hmm. Oh, dilemma. The dilemma. I've got to go to the pharmacy in a moment to pick up more of your scripts than to Woolworths. So... My gosh, how many scripts have I got? That's a few. Just, just a couple. Uh-oh. Just a few. Uh oh. Hey, right. Just How a few. How many? There's a few. There's a few to be done. Oh my goodness. Are you playing dead? Attack. Can you see him? Look at this. Attack. Attack. Yeah, watch your fingers. Attack. He, he grabs well, that one. Okay, love bites only. Right, <laughs> right. Be gentle. I'm pretending so he doesn't. You're so bark dramatic, hard. mummy. No, but you have to. Otherwise, he'll just. He doesn't understand. I get that he's that. hurting me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm teaching him lessons. You're such a good boy. Tell them that you're going in and what's ha what are you getting done at the vet? What's happening at the vet, sir? Oh, my sir? God. It's not all about the balls again, is it? It's about the balls. Yeah, it's Ooh. coming up next week, okay. young man. I'm he sorry. He me. He knows about the snip. Mm-hmm. But you know what has to be done? It actually is, you know, he's an indoor cat only. But when he plays with his brother... You know, being a kitten, he's, he gets rough, but he'll settle down because the testosterone will settle down because it does make a male cat more aggressive yeah. when they're not done. I like Paul's comment on Facebook this morning, his meme. Right, he's, he's good. He's good. Yeah, good. We're in the UK. He's, he's part of the MEC good. crew. Yes, uh, MEC look, was I funny. think broke into his house last night <gasps> searching for money, oh. so he got up and searched with him. I do the same thing. I think you would as well. Can that thief come here and help me find some? I like to find some. He's <laughs> honey bugger. Very good. <laughs> yes, disability life. Oh, it yes. is indeed. That's pretty much it. So <sighs> cheers to a coffee, guys. Um, how are you? Hope your day is gonna be good. Hope your week has been good. It's only Wednesday, but it is. Did you remember well, it was Wednesday? Well, most of the time I don't remember the days, but I did get it right today, you, didn't I? You did. Ah, ah, well but done, But basically, yeah. <laughs> you might not see this on a Wednesday, so sorry about that. But, like, I get excited, and I did a video last night because I was so excited. Oh. And you, you'll see why. It was to pretty cool. Ball, More collections. Ball, oh, my God, you and the balls. Another ball. And another hey, collection, by the way. you can't talk. You scored. I did. Not in that way. You scored. <laughs> And her terrace has actually been um, a bit rammed up in the last couple of days because of the oh, higher yeah. temperatures and what's going on. So, so we are on seizure alert, aren't we? I'll shut up about that one. Yeah. So basically, he like there's five things in it. He got three of them and I got two. I'm wrapped with my two, don't get me wrong. But he did well, didn't you? Well, that's it. I didn't ask for it, but... I'm not going to say anymore. You're you gonna just have, have to watch, watch and you have to subscribe. So guys, don't forget to give us a big thumbs up if you like our channel. Don't forget to subscribe so you can watch more content as it comes up. If you've got you, questions you or like comments, our, leave them our below. Our weird conversations and our, our weirdness. Yeah, join join the club. Indeed. Um, we are the sanity club. Are we? There's a lot going on in the world. Yeah. A lot of crazy stuff. There it is. And we're here to, like... Bring keep you the sanity. Sane. Indeed. Sounds Although, good to me. is it the other way around? Are you guys keeping us sane? I hope so too. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see you soon in another episode. Thing, isn't it? Bye for now, guys. <laughs> Bye. See ya.